The start of the school year can be very exciting for many students. With the school year comes football, fine arts, and extracurricular activities. However, the start of the school year also means dealing with a hectic parking lot. For anyone who drives a car, this can mean a multitude of problems. Students are having issues with the parking permit as well as driving and being picked up after school. Students express how they feel about this issue. Um, it's pretty frustrating, if I'm going to be honest. It's really annoying, like, when you just want to get, like, out of school and go home and then you have to, like, sit there for 15 minutes. I usually park pretty close to the exit because I'll get to school really early, but sometimes it can take, like, 15 minutes. Students are also not informed on the parking permit. Mr. McGuire, the parking lot attendant, and Ms. Soli tell us more. Just so we could justify and make sure you're a student here and if you leave your lights on or the car's running, whatever, we have a way to contact the front office. It's district mandated, and the reason why we have it is so that we could make sure that everybody who parks on this campus is um, secure, it's for their safety. So we need to make sure that we know that people are insured and just in case something happens to a car, we know who the car belongs to. So it's important for parents to stick to those zones since they're the ones who drive. But um, just for safety, because we have the crosswalk for kids to go back and forth across the street. And then we have certain areas for pick up and drop off because we have a very congested parking lot. And we want to make sure that people get where they're supposed to go and they do it in a safe manner. For now, the parking lot may seem hectic. But as the school year continues, it will get less and less frantic, as long as drivers work together to minimize traffic. This has been Dan Levine, Micah Henriksen, Nick French, Will Snook, Turner Corey, and Xavion Basinger for WEN TV.